Earlier today, Major League Baseball announced a few rule modifications for the 2024 season. Most notably, the league saying it thinks it could shave five more minutes off games by cutting the time between pitches from 20 seconds to 18 with men on base. The allowed mound visits will be trimmed from five to four, and the runners lane at first base will now be extended to the infield grass, allowing base runners to run on the fair territory side of the baseline. Any of those jump out at you, Michael, or agree or disagree? Well, I don't think the, the players will like it, but I think the 18 second is fine. No, nobody really got caught, and nobody was really close, so I think that's fine that they cut it down the two seconds. The one thing that I wanted them to do, because if you look at the way the times of the game progressed, at the beginning of the year, it was about 235, right through for five months, and then in September, it went up to over 245. So 10 minutes were gained, and I think the thing that they had to do, they have to stop the players from calling timeouts. Every single at bat a player has at least one timeout they got used to it they started to figure it out and when they did that that extended the game so I think players do need to have a timeout every now and then but it should only be allowed seventh inning on when the really every at bat means something it's going to be difficult to police that because Michael's right we saw as the season wore on that people were saying wait this is moving too fast for me I'm going to take a timeout I agree with Michael on the two second difference they have the numbers pitchers were letting the ball go with about seven seconds left on the clock average so why not shave off another two seconds I like adding the space to the runners lane hopefully if there's any close or controversial plays that extra space will make them less controversial and I also liked one rule a little bit under the radar though but there were situations last year where they would bring a pitcher in to rel for relief or he would start the inning on the mound and he would throw the seven or eight warm-ups and then they pull him out of the game. So now if you start your warm-ups, you're coming in the game. That's the one that I really like, right? Because I think it puts a lot more pressure and emphasis on managers to be prepared with their bullpen guys that they need to be ready to go. You can't send a starter out there to throw his eight warm-up pitches while you get a reliever going. You have to be on it a little bit more. I think that's also going to save some time. And they also shave 15 seconds off when a relief pitcher comes out of the bullpen and gets to the mound. So it used to be, I think, 230 they could yep. you know, warm up. Now it's going to be 215. So they're working on it. I think they did great last year. I don't think the players will like it. They don't like to be legislated against, but I understand what baseball's trying to do. You need a shorter program and more better pace, should I say.